In 2021, Step Change and Safety introduced its quarterly themes model of delivery with the intention of providing our member companies advance notice of the four key safety themes and supporting resources that would be deployed throughout the four quarters of the year. Member companies could then align their internal safety initiatives to coincide with our quarterly themes, which in turn would provide consistent messaging to both core and transient workers across the energy sector. This would also reduce the potential for initiative overlap and duplication of effort amongst member companies while increasing focus on the four key quarterly safety themes. The introduction of the themed approach has been well received and proved to be successful across our membership. It has also seen an increase in collaboration through the sharing of member developed resources to support specific quarters. As our membership reach continues to attract global interest, we looked to like-minded organisations with a view to gaining further support for our quarterly approach. It was at this time we recognised that our Norwegian counterparts, Always Safe, had also been using a similar approach in promoting safety themes on a quarterly basis, albeit slightly differently to our own. We had also been talking with Safer Together, Australia's equivalent of Step Change in Safety, regarding the potential for increased collaboration and sharing of safety resources. We formally contacted both organisations to explore the potential for aligning our combined efforts around four key themes and have, over the last few months, reached an agreement with Always Safe and Safer Together to adopt the following quarterly themes going forward. Q1, Prevention of Major Accidents. Q2, Prevention of Personal Injuries. Q3, Safe Lifting, Working at Height and Preventing Dropped Objects. And Q4, Mental Health, Wellbeing and Work Environment. The benefits of this increased alignment for step change in safety members and the UK sector include potential for our members to increase collaboration on key safety themes across their global businesses, potential to share resources across all three organisations, create a clear alignment and commonality for safety messaging in the UK, Norwegian and Australian regions. We see this as a very positive development towards improving awareness and understanding in key safety topics across the global energy community. As a result of this collaborative project, we now share a common goal of raising awareness and understanding with like-minded organisations who are committed to improving safety across the global energy sector. Simply put, we share a mutual goal of ensuring our workforce return home safely to their families, colleagues and friends from their respective places of work. I would like to thank our friends at Always Safe and Safer Together for entering into this collaborative partnership for the greater good of those who are employed in the energy sector.